hi everyone welcome back to another video um, in this video guys I'm gonna be uh, pretty clear and uh, I'm gonna tell you about the biggest issue of PTD6 right now and hopefully this is gonna be solved in a couple months uh, I hope and um, the problem uh, is that the game is still uh, being updated and uh, the towers, heroes, knowledge, all that stuff is being uh, changed and it's being balanced and uh, the changes are pretty huge and so uh, the main problem is that um, you cannot really give or upload any videos showing strategies for example in Impopable or Chimps or uh, whatever other uh, game mode you cannot really do uh, any strategy because of the fact that in, uh, in the future, in the next patch, in the next update, that strategy uh, will not be viable anymore uh, because of the changes on the towers, the cost, the, the effects of the upgrades uh, and uh, our costs are still changing. So uh, I cannot afford to do a video uh, that in a couple of weeks may become useless to follow because my main goal as a YouTuber, as someone that uh, does gameplays, is that I want to provide uh, my subscribers, but in general, players that want to, that can't beat a certain map in a certain difficulty, uh, I want to be able to provide them with a strategy without like a tutorial that they can follow and in that way they can be able to beat that map but by following my my video uh, but if uh, in a couple of uh, weeks um, the game gets updated my strategy becomes useless so no one can follow it and therefore the video itself becomes useless because um, it's not helpful for anyone so um, yeah this is unfortunate and I think this is uh, a lack of testing before the release of the game uh, because having uh, still the towers being balanced after all this time that the game has been released seems to me that uh, the testing of the game wasn't quite enough and, uh, and yeah, I don't understand uh, why they're still uh, fixing or buffing or nerfing certain aspects of the game that, um, yeah. So uh, unfortunately, um, this game is not a multiplayer online game. Uh, so it doesn't need perma changes. Uh, you don't need to perma update the towers first of all because of the fact that the in-game mechanics do not change so how the rounds are which balloons spawn in a certain round uh, is always the same of course there are different modes but these modes are already set up and Ninja Kiwi is not really changing uh, these rounds or the the game modes the only thing that is changing is the the, the towers and uh, the heroes uh the monkey knowledge and all the so all the issues relating to the towers and um and that's pretty disappointing my point of view and uh, but yeah so um until the game get gets more balanced and it's not touched anymore so until uh, I'm going to be seeing that with the updates, the towers are almost left without any change. Uh, that is when I'm going to start doing strategies and gameplays uh, because I know that my strategy will still be usable by everyone, even after months and months and months or even after years. So uh, in that way, the videos are, are useful and, uh, and that's all that matters, you know? So, um, yeah, this is unfortunate 
and uh, I'm gonna try do some BTD six probably tutorials. Um, for example, just showing the different monkeys, the different tree upgrades, uh, the different paths. Maybe showing you know the weaknesses and the and the strongs about every every tower. But again, uh, everything is gonna be hypothetical because of the fact that the tower may um, change with the next patch or the next update and so uh, even these tutorials are going to be um, not 100% accurate because in the future uh, the, the the towers themselves the upgrades may uh, be changed so uh, yeah this is sad and uh, yeah I just wanted to do this video to uh, explain to everyone my point of view and why I will not be doing any uh, gameplays so, see ya. Bye-bye.